so guys the rave of the moment now is that uh, all these politicians their children now are now as of refugees they are senators left right and center um this man ekiti state uh, the former ekiti state governor fire she his son again in data state oh uh, the likes of uh, the incumbent governor okowa ibori their daughters they are now they've not they are not politicians they've been elected as a as of rep or whatever whatever they are giving to them and that is the reigning thing now but the funniest part of it is that the s uh presidents of uh, this country the one that is a vice president to jonathan yeah namadi his son now i think he failed woefully i think a uh, udua daughter too udua's daughter she didn't make it again but uh, that's of a uh, bori and okowa the their two daughters those ones they made it so that is just the rave of the moment now they are they are not even hiding it you know before now you just hear that say oh this one so 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 and so is like is there just like a uh, lai mohammed's son too is only one position in lagos and he's from washington state let's not go there they will tell you maybe his mother is from a uh, lagos or something but they have been fixing themselves now that is just what they are trying to do now and they are not even hiding it and they will not say that say oh they are they are very they are qualified let's 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 wait and see but now the issue on ground now is that the ex vice president to good luck jonathan namadi his son adam namadi son of former vice president namadi sambu is asking kaduna delegates to refund his money following his defeat at the primaries despite having paid about 76 million naira. go and ask how did this boy make it oh they will tell you his father is a was a vice president so uh this and this and that what kind of job are they doing all of them what business are they doing to get this kind of thing that's that's, the, that's what they are that is what's being play, played out now because the is bidder says it all 76 million era the younger namadi was hoping to become the 2023 people's democratic party pdp flag bearer to represent kaduna north federal constituency at the house of representatives and you go and check out this their children they school abroad at the end of the day they, no single development will come i think a like Mohammed's son is there even bani korotu all of their children tell me meaningful development they have brought to their constituency they are going to say most of the people say don't even know that they are even represent representing them no single no single development whatsoever they are just there collecting salary i think uh, some of these governors now the likes of your tom and the rest now they are they have won to be senate after they are gone ah, it's just it's just unfortunate all of them are the same none of them has single plan for this country none of them now this one has wasted 76 million naira. now he's not crying he's crying wolf now he gave them money and that is exactly what all of them are doing even this a uh, presidential whatever they are doing his hope was however short lived when he scored only two votes hey they don't do a take at the primary election putting him at 12 votes behind the runner up mr namadi had paid two billion naira to each delegate spending about 76 million naira to secure the ticket he assured the delegates of an additional 1.5 million naira each upon clinching the ticket so where is he going to get the money to to offset the whole thing the incumbent member of the House of Representatives of the, for the Cardona North Federal Constituency won the ticket with 22 votes ahead of Shehu Ehman with 14 votes. Party delegates of different cadres continue to take home millions of naira from political aspirants seeking to woo them. Public intellectuals have warned that the monetization of the process is not likely to present candidates able to deliver the quick fix that the country urgently needs and that is it no single development oh, they are just fixing themselves just be eating nigeria money all of them ego poor jaw of now because you your forefathers every all of them they've they've, they've destroyed this country and they are not putting you there i think you are even you know if you are if you are doing meaningful things and people can see things fine if you are being paid all the money they are being paid well apart from the one that is even stealing the ones they are being they are being paid they are not even working for the money you are just being paid for nothing at the end of the day you will still destroy the country all of you all the money will purge all of you 
you think you guys you 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 you, you, you be satisfied you will not be satisfied all of them they are doing it now that you know it doesn't matter you know nothing will happen not even will not fall we can do and undo all of them they are in that cartel none of them can even stay abroad because they know that they will not be getting all this free money nigeria is the headquarter of people living in adjust poverty but you see all these politicians say they are living light you can go and check this rec the record of this guy even though that his father maybe his father's gave his father gave him money or they have gotten the money in a in a, in a you know in an awkward manner because I see no reason why I don't know how what and what he has done in his life to get this kind of money. If not that uh, all of them are deep in their hands inside Kukija. Now he's crying wolf. Now they've, they've, they don't grant sick. It is fair to say that politicians are mere traders looking to make profit from the sweat of the masses. Very unfortunate. P masses are suffering. They are suffering. Yet these guys, they cannot even... E even if you are going to be... You want to even eat out of the, from the cookie jar do something let's people have, i don't just understand they don't even care whether this country has integrity whether this country is something you know a country to be reckoned with whether the country has a integrity outside the country they don't care they don't care all they want is just for them to have a people who are going to bow down before them who are going to be slaves that is just all they want and they will be local champions once they get there forget it whether nigeria is crumbling whether we are respected or whatever is none of their business. In as much the immediate people are there respecting them. The sweat of the masses. A man who bribes 38 delegates with 2 billion naira each would end up stealing billions. If given the opportunity, he deserves no refund. I would love to be hearing this kind of news from the primaries. You could have asked your dad before venturing into politics. Laughable. Did they dig their hands into his pocket to take the money? This every four years political festival have come again. Delegates are cashing out daily from gates. Your 76 million naira cash has gone back to the to where it comes from. It is possible. Is it possible to get back the salt put inside water? No, no. Ujorara, at all. What they did to him is called political yawu yawu. He shouldn't ask for refund. It is a good start. Let him continue on the foundation lead. Well done job for by delegates. Nobody should return the money. It is our money. You know well, a youth like you went and spent 76 million to enable you win primary election. We are trying to kick out corruption from those useless bygone old cargos. You youth are encouraging it and went and paid such amounts of money to useless old elements like yours efcc needs to pick you up by now where did he get the money from i am happy they dished him out they are rightly collected what belongs to them part of the national cake your father stood the delegates have done well we do not even understand your pain young man is it the same pain people your father deprived of their livelihood by looting their commonwealth fee money received in good condition is not refundable 76 million naira that was siphoned from federal post has equally been siphoned by another set of smarter politicians you were not informed to hmm. no refund the money is gone lessons to learn from delegates we are expecting more politicians to cry out. Even those saying they will fight corruption during the <laughs> campaign. We see share dollars to delegates. Niger, <laughs> good hello. After God, fear delegates. Is see a thief? What is he expecting? Can't INEC EFCC do something radical concerning the sharing of money by money bags politicians? Is INEC incapacitated of course they are incapacitated what can they do <laughs> they are looking at the body language of the man that appointed them buhari so guys so that's it oh. let's hear your opinion on this